Don't forget the one from your dad. Okay, it's not a car, so I'm going with my second choice. It must be tickets to the Britney Spears concert. Surprise! Dad! If the rest of you isn't a Porsche, I'm the happiest girl in the world. <laughs> I guess that explains the air holes. <laughs> I'm afraid my present is a little bit selfish this year. Men's shoes again? No, I'm semi-retiring from the other realm foreign service, so I'm gonna be settling down. I want you to come to Paris and live with me. Live with you? Right now? Well, of course not. She needs time to pack. Dad, I don't know what to say. I know, how about thanks, but no thanks? Would you excuse us? We have to check on those cakes. Mm. Oh. I can't let him do this. He can't just pop in here and take our Sabrina away. He's her father. Of course he can. We knew this day would come. Yes, but not for a long, long time. Oh, not fair. And there are paw prints all over my cake. When I'm upset, I eat. Now listen, you've got to promise me that you're not gonna try to influence Sabrina's decision. If she wants to leave us, well... Dad, I'll be right back. <laughs> Isn't this fantastic? Dad said he and Gail live in the Magic Quarter in Paris, and their apartment is actually in the Eiffel Tower. Think about how many thousands of Japanese snapshots I'll be in. Are you crying? Onions. New cake recipe. Sometimes I just don't understand Martha Stewart. Happy birthday. Wow, this must be a fantastic party. You two look like you're having a really good time. <laughs> Tickets to the Britney Spears concert. Actually, they're parking lot passes. We have to listen to the concert from outside, but we might get to see her when she runs through her limo. Woohoo! Parking lot passes to the Britney Spears concert. You know, Sabrina, I think this is gonna be the best year ever. So I just don't think I can go right now. I mean, there's Harvey, and senior year starts tomorrow, and I have a friend moving in with me, and I hear the French can be really rude. Sabrina, it's okay. I understand. Just promise me you'll think about it. I miss having you close by. I promise. <laughs> Checking each other for chiggers. <laughs> Please tell me this means what I think it means. That my mother was right and I should have taken those classes to become a court reporter? No, that Mr. Kraft is not coming back, thus proving that prayers are answered. They told me to take his name off the door. New vice principal starts today. No Libby, no Kraft, so this is what it's like to peek. Hey, guess what? Well, if my day keeps going the way it's been going, you've got gold for me? No, but I have news. You remember Brad? Your best friend who moved back to Texas, the guy who used to burn ants with a magnifying glass? That's the guy, and he's back. Come on, can't wait for you to meet him. Oh, glad to see you learned how to catch while I was gone. Hi, Brad. Oh, hey, right back at you, Courtney. <laughs> hey, Brad, I'd like you to meet Sabrina. Sabrina? Oh, it's about time. Hi. Hi. Hey, Charlie. Nice to meet you, too. Isn't he great? Yeah, good thing I don't have a thorax. 